All right. Hey, everybody. My name is Rob Satram, and I'm the owner of Feedback Crunch. We help companies with their websites, their paid ads. And today I want to talk about if you own a seal coat company, I just got some things I want to talk about. Five different kind of lead funnel um, tips, things that are going to help you fill your sales funnel and ultimately drive more traffic to your website, get more conversions. And I'm telling you, if you don't have an excellent website and an excellent paid advertising campaign, head to feedbackrunch.com. We'd love to help you out. I love helping Seal Coat companies. It's really kind of a sweet spot for us. We can set you up with an excellent website and do a lot. So let's just talk about Seal Coat company, uh, kind of web design and paid advertising. Um, so if you own a Seal Coat or an asphalt company and you're looking to fill your sales funnel with new leads, then we, we'd love to help you here at Feedback Ranch, right? Uh, we specialize in helping Seal Coat companies get a website that actually converts. That's a big difference. And then fill your sales funnel with great leads for both residential and those commercial parking lot seal coating companies. Um, now, I'm going to hit on four or five different things that you can focus on uh, to actually increase the amount of leads that you're going to get. Number one is really about building a website that actually converts. Number two is about building up your Google and Facebook reviews. Number three is to show the trust that you've earned on your website. Number four is to optimize your pay for paid ads and then dominate with Google and Bing paid search ads. I can't emphasize this enough. If you talk to my customers that are in the seal coding companies uh, that we help, we fill their sales. Funnel. They are dominating everybody in their region because of the paid search ads that we do. Um, and then the last thing I'd say, ignore Facebook and Instagram except for two things. So that's like a little... A little hook there. Um, there's two reasons why you'd want to use Facebook and Instagram, but they're in very specific situations. So first off, we have really affordable options to get a high converting website. We, It doesn't have to take $10,000 to get an excellent website. That's absolutely nonsense. And we can set up a highly optimized ad campaign along with it through Google search ads and Bing search ads. And if you're looking to get started or finally take control of gaining market share, which is what it's all about, then go ahead and go to feedbackrench.com and you can book on my calendar. We can get you all set up. So everything that we do is about getting full utilization of your business, right? We understand that your business is really about utilization. Now, most people don't think about that, but seal co companies are really trying to make sure that they have a steady flow of residential and commercial business throughout the year so that they can maximize the utilization of your crew and of all of your machinery, right? That's really what it's all about. So real quick, let's hit on Seal Coat Company websites that are built to convert because um, that's really our specialty, right? We build websites that are optimized for more than just looking good. They're optimized for Google ads. They're optimized for SEO, and they're going to help your company get a steady flow of uh of business, right? Not only that, but we're going to make sure that they're built to convert and win trust and convey um, all of the things that need to happen so that people actually choose you. Some of the things that we focus on is to make sure that there's clear calls to action on mobile and desktop. We make sure that they're optimized for speed and responsiveness so that they work well on a phone and on desktop. And then we make sure that you get good form and email deliverability when people actually contact you. Our websites all have a super secure SSL and they're ultra fast because they're on AWS Amazon hosting. Uh, we, we set up Google, Facebook and Yelp reviews and showcase them on your website. And we're not like most website companies that you get this anemic SEO on your website. We're going to provide full bodied search engine optimization, including like good, powerful schema markup, meta titles, meta descriptions, a site map. We're going to submit it to Google and Bing's uh, webmaster. We're going to make sure that your website is set up to rank and we understand local SEO better than just about anybody else. Lastly, we kind of have a landing page system that we set up um, so that you can do this Google ads optimization. It could be that it, you use this landing page system for locations or different services or whatever that looks like. And then last, um, we have a process that makes sure that this whole website looks great, functions well, and conveys who you are. So uh, go to feedbackrench.com and under the About Us, there's a tab that talks about or shows you our work. And if you just take a look at the different websites that we built, you'll see that uh, we do really good work. I'm proud of our design team. I'm proud, proud of our writers. And uh, I tell you what, it'll just... I think you'll want to do business with us. So let's talk about website trust factors because the other thing that we work hard to do is to implement custom branding photography and then help to instill the trust factors that you have for your business, right? So by displaying your company's true identity instead of just stock photography and then showcasing the reviews that you've worked so hard to obtain, if you don't have them, that's part of the coaching that we're going to go through. You'll see on that your website has a higher tendency to convert more people than the typical seal coat kind of turn and burn stock photography or just 
uh, business card website that you're going to see out there. I'm telling you folks, trust factors by showing your work and showing your reviews are really going to help people um, want to do business with you. And there's no reason in driving more traffic to a website unless it's actually going to convert. And we specialize in that. In fact, if you look at any of our websites, we give you the best chance to convert of any of the website builders out there. Um, now, the second thing I want to talk about is how do you actually build up your Facebook and Google reviews? Now, let's just talk about why that's important because nothing is going to help your seal coat and asphalt company more than getting more Google and Facebook reviews than your competitors. I'm telling you, that is one of the most important things that you can do right now. Reviews are the new referral system, right? Old school guys used to talk about referrals being the best. They still are the best. But essentially, a, a Google review or a Facebook review is the same thing as a referral. And if you can build up more reviews on Google My Business as well as Facebook, you're going to see that you'll drive more traffic. You're going to convert more leads and you'll build much more momentum in your region and in your sector. I'm telling you, it'll actually help you build up a business that's worth selling in the future because so much of your digital action is tied to your Google My Business uh, reviews. Digital marketing for asphalt and steel coat companies is really about local SEO. And local SEO is really tied to this idea that the distance between your company and the searcher is really important. Whenever that's a good factor, you're going to see that the Google My Business search engine uh, feature on the SERP, which we call the search is the search engine result page, is super important. So when you search parking lot, seal coat near me, or seal coat companies, or seal coating near me, the search engine result page is going to show local features. In fact, if we hit on what's actually shown on the search engine result page, you're going to see that the first thing is Google ads. That's the most prominent thing. Number two is the Google My Business. Number three are organic search results. Um, now, Facebook reviews, let's hit on this real quick. So local SEO is going to be most important in that you're going to have Google ads and then your Google My Business. We're going to talk about why that's so important in just a second. But Facebook reviews are actually important for the same thing because Facebook reviews are utilized by Bing, Microsoft Bing places. And Windows laptops or Windows computers use Bing a lot more than what most people realize. In fact, Facebook reviews matter primarily because they're used by Microsoft Bing Places, and Bing Places is often used on a Windows machine almost sneakily. You won't even know you're using Bing because it looks identical to Google. And even Xboxes now are starting to use Bing searches. So Google reviews are going to help you. So will Facebook reviews. They're going to do a couple of things. They're going to lead to more traffic, and you're going to get more conversions. Um, in fact, Really, the goal is to have more reviews than everybody else in your industry within your region or within your local area. You'll see that more people will start to click on your business when searching for a seal coat company when you have more reviews. Duh. And if you can have as many or more reviews as the top three in your region, you'll start to get a massive increase in your traffic, right? Um, now, Google reviews will also help Google ads. A lot of people don't know this. Um, I'll hit on it in a little bit here, but when you have a top three amount of Google reviews, like you're the top three in your area, you'll have a great deal of success when you run Google paid search ads for your seal coat keywords. Um, while, and, and something I want to hit on real quick is that organic traffic and Google reviews and just organic SEO is super important for business, but you'll see that Google ads are actually the most predictable way to drive leads to your sales funnel. Um, and there's a lot of reasons for that. Mainly, it's just Google wants to drive uh, people to use their ad product, right? So the next thing that we want to do is just talk about how do you show the trust that you've earned on your website? And I'm going to keep this short. You know, if you get all the best Google ads and traffic and SEO heading to your website, but there's nothing on there that helps you win the trust of people or show the trust that you've earned, it's not going to convert. People aren't going to want to do business with you. So the way we do this is by showing your reviews. Um, and we kind of talked about that a little bit already, but customers want to see that you're doing work in their area as well. And the more before and after photos that you can show on your website, it sounds really simple, that will help a ton. So show before and after, show the date on those pictures, and also show the city that you're in so that people can see that you're in their area. When you show the, the work that you're doing, whether it's a parking lot or a residential driveway, you should tag those pictures and sort them by location, almost like a blog category, right? When you could tag your work by city, eventually you can create location landing pages on your website through that landing page system we talked about and put those photos kind of as check-ins 
with special markup on them so that when people get to like the Lakeville page or a hyper localized Google ad is driving to a specific location page, you're going to see that people are going to be excited that you do work in their area. They're going to know that you're worthy of trust and it helps a lot. In fact, those hyper local landing pages take time to build out. But in competitive regions, like the more competitive your region is, the more important it is to use a hyper-localized, hyper-optimized landing page, not only for paid search advertising, but for SEO, right? If you've got a handful of suburbs that you want to win in or maybe some exterior or some more uh, further out locations, by having specific landing pages made for those regions, you're going to help build momentum over the years. It's going to help you convert, get a higher um <coughs> paid ad search rank, which is kind of an interesting thing. We'll hit on that later. But um, the bottom line, guys, is that you want to show the work that you've done, show your reviews so that people can trust you a little bit more. If you've got customer testimonials, that's even better. Um, But that's super important to hit on those trust factors. So then real quick, we'll swing into how do you optimize for paid ads and then dominate with Google and Bing paid search ads, which is really the core of what we do. You know, paid search ads are the number one way to drive consistent sales for your business. Google Ads takes up the first and most prominent area of the search engine result page, and Google is just going to keep going there with that. Google Ads will also show on the Google My Business, if you didn't know that. Um, So in the Google My Business section, you'll see that it says add if you add what's called a location extension and you win the Google ad, right? So Google My Business even has Google Ads on it. Now, organic traffic is great because it's free, but what you'll see is that organic traffic is incredibly unpredictable and it's spotty at best, particularly over the long term. So what makes organic traffic more unpredictable and unreliable? There's a couple little things here, right? So you got regional competitors can easily replace you or squeeze out some of your search engine um, optimization. Algorithm changes can kill your SEO ranking organics are low on the actual result pages. Like if you just look at where the organic results are, they're very low. Users need to be close to your business or close to your Google My Business in order to rank organically. Third-party aggregators like Angie's List will gobble up your organic traffic. And then Google Home Services, which I haven't hit on yet. This is this separate type of advertising. Um, But this Google Home Services or Google Guarantee can show up in your sector and in your region and just kind of spoil all your organic work that you've done. So it's really important to focus on optimizing for paid search advertising. And I love organic traffic. But you just need to realize that even if you work voodoo magic for years, your search engine optimization efforts can become useless really quick. Now, Google makes money from Google Ads, too. you got to remember this. And you can rest assured that Google will find ways to keep its revenue humming over the years. Um, So that's going to be the most predictable thing. The main problem I found is that more and more seal code companies improve their digital marketing over time, right? Everybody's getting better at this. And they're getting better at the Google My Business game. And you'll see that each region just has an increased pressure and it becomes more competitive. As each region has more companies vying for the search traffic organically, you'll see that the organic traffic becomes even tougher to secure, right? It just gets really hard. Now, we know how to get leads on Google Ads, but we only kind of know how to get leads on on SEO, right? That's the other thing is Google is very cryptic when it comes to uh, search engine optimization. We know that if we get more reviews than everybody else, if we attract backlinks and we have quality content marked up properly on our website, we're going to be in great position for organic traffic, but it's still unpredictable. The organic algorithms are secret and they're shrouded and your best bet is to do simple things over time like I talked about. Um, But your organic traffic can be really finicky. So just long story short, paid search ads are a very predictable way for you to continue to get traffic, fill your sales funnel and stay busy through the spring, the fall. Maybe you're in a warm area um, where people are seal coding all the time. But here in Minneapolis or in the northern hemisphere, we know that you have the the spring and the fall and you want to make sure that you have um, equal utilization through the year. So I'm telling you, paid search ads are where it's at. And then you can do short remarketing ads, which that's number five here. I want you to ignore Facebook and Instagram ads except for two instances. Um, A lot of people ask, are Facebook and Instagram advertising any good for like seal coat lead generation? And in my opinion, Facebook and Instagram ads, which are like disruptive advertising, are really only good for two things for your business. Now, I'll jump into them here real quick, but the main thing I want you to know is that Facebook and Instagram are missing the most important factor for marketing, 
and that's timing. Timing is everything in sales, right? You need to have the right product at the right value proposition at the right price and at the right time. If you're not there when it's time to buy, you're going to be out of luck. And if you're there at the right time, um, you're going to get the order. So Facebook and Instagram can be great, but in general, it's terrible because you're paying to push marketing to people who don't want your service, right? There's no way to truly qualify them. Um, Now, there's two Facebook and Instagram advertising strategies that I think are worth it. So the first one is seasonal group discounts to neighborhoods, and then the second part is remarketing. So let's get this out of the way. Facebook marketing definitely can work, but it's just unpredictable because you're missing timing. And by not having a keyword behind it, there's no intent to show that people are ready to actually take action. It's particularly unpredictable now that the machine learning conversion tracking is gone in iOS 14. You know, it's it's made fourth or whatever of 2021 and iOS just kind of took away some of the machine learning factors of Facebook which make your ads dumber so if you run a get a discount neighborhood ad though you'll see that people might flock to your offer now I've seen this in in lawn care and I've seen this in seal coating work Um, so the idea is that you can create a landing page for a neighborhood and then you offer what's called a same trip discount right And I'm telling you, same trip discounts are huge. Too many of you are running all over the city for too small of a transaction. I can't emphasize this enough. You should work hard to carry forward the idea that if a person can get their neighbors to get seal coating done on the same day in the same trip, you should offer a huge discount because you don't have to drive all over. Nothing is better than getting to do an entire street worth of neighborhood driveway seal coating or even a couple of parking lots in one trip. In fact, I challenge you that the thing that makes your business unprofitable is that you're driving far too far away and chasing too small of deals, wasting time paying people to sit in your cars or you sitting in your truck trying to get on location, right? If you can transform a small deal into a larger deal by offering kind of the same trip discount, it's huge. Now, you don't need to have these location landing pages, but this is a tool that we have within our website that you can use. Here's what you can do to encourage the same day discount, right? So when you actually do get a customer, give them their own landing page for the neighborhood and tell them if they post this on social media, they can work off and get a giant discount. Um, On that landing page, you'll be able to have people line up to say, hey, I'm willing to um, sacrifice a little bit of my flexibility in order to have a discount, right? And that's really what you're trying to do. Have people be flexible um, so that they can get a discount. And I'm telling you, people are frugal enough that they'll want to do this. You just need to give them a clear path to do it and, and things will happen. In fact, there are many industries that could benefit for this thing. Um, concrete aprons, lawn care, landscaping, roofing, siding, and, and even some construction stuff, right? Now, we've achieved some great results, us feedback wrench here working with Sealco companies, and we're confident that our website and marketing setup is going to be spectacular for your business. Um, I gave you some ideas here. I would love the opportunity to connect with you. Go to feedbackwrench.com. Our mission is to help amplify your efforts to help fill your sales funnel so that you can focus on your business. Ultimately, when we set up a website for you, um, we know how to do this really well. We're going to help set up ads that will fill your sales funnel. In fact, you can take a look at some of uh, the results that we've gotten from our customers. Just head to the testimonials page on feedbackranch.com. We'd love to help you. Good luck. God bless. And I really appreciate the time.